He come to me with septums in his hand. He offered me. I didn't ask him. I wasn't knocking someone's door down. I was running from that. When I got out, I was in that. I was already through that. I had that. I had the studio. I went to studio. I went to Vivek studio. I had it all. And I looked at it and said, this is a bigger jail than I just got out of. I don't want to take my time going to work. I got a heart of Lorcan and a Kagranax tools and 10 or 15 sleepers. What the hell I want to go off into and go to work for? Work for what? Septums. I got all the septums in the world. I'm the god man. I run the six house guy. I decide whose does what and where they do it at. What am I gonna run around and act like I'm some mongrel dog of the empire for somebody else's septums? I make the septums, man. I roll the soul gems. The chim is mine. I deal the cards. <laughs> I mean, if that was an actual in-game cinematic. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. All right. Um, I mean, come on. Let me just very quickly stop the stream. Ah, the problem when I when I tab out of Test 3 MP, when I like click something on the other screen, it tabs out of Test 3 MP, which is quite annoying. Um, anyway, I'm... Hit, whoa, 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 where are you guys? Let's see some corpses. I'm... I'm Dagotha. <laughs> um, Golden and Boy? Crime has been reported by by Air. You've done so many crimes at this point. I don't think anyone in in, in Vardenfell hasn't borne witness to them. Dagothair's got the fucking outslaughtered guards on the phone. Like he's here. Please, <laughs> please, please come. Well, we are waiting for but one more. Ah, oh. we've assembled, we've convened. Already you're getting ready to kill each other, that's good. That's a good sign. Right, we're here. This is the big one. I trust we're all well rested and ready for our final challenge. We've rid Vardenfell. Of, well, firstly, these horrific ash storms and all the ash blight and the wretched creatures, and obviously the heinous, mind-controlled infiltrators who don't even get to dream proper dreams. Yeah, they're turning just, life has become a waking sad, nightmare for them and for the people they are obviously constantly attacking and in greater and greater numbers. Well, we know why we're here. We know our cause is a just one to honor. Saint Nerevar of times long past. Therefore, yeah. let us not me. stand on ceremony. Let us steal ourselves and head right in. You guys ready? Steal. Ah. Come, Nerevar, friend or traitor, come. Come and look upon the hawk and the Kula. <laughs> And bring Wraithguard. I have need of it. For me, he yelled so loudly that it froze me for a moment. <laughs> like, not paralysis, like, just in-game. Well, excuse me, not in-game. Come game, to right. the heart chamber. I wait for you there where we last met countless ages ago. Uh, again, every time he speaks, like, my game freezes. <laughs> it's... It's Jim. He already knows we're here.
Oh, sorry. You know what? Let's walk. Let's walk through here. Hit caps lock, I think, by default. It's, it's three doors. We're just going to walk intimidatingly throughout this. Oh, Hopefully I can eat some magicka. Well, I ate it, but with my face rather than with my soul. I could use a bit of magic. Um, before we go further down over here, I think we missed a couple of bits upstairs, so let's just make sure we've cleared every nook and cranny. It looks like the matching door on the far left would also lead down here. I'm intrigued where that middle door goes. It's Wait, are you... Is there. that your walking speed? 100 acrobatics, my dude. This is my walking speed. I, I mean, it's still a bit of a hustle. By the nine. Well, by... By the three? By My walking speed, I'm still pretty. <laughs> <laughs> That's power walking for sure. The hustle and bustle. Uh, lightning shield. Bit of gold. F fortify intelligence. So, uh, gold, we could use that. Some delicious Dwemer scrap metal. Well, eat it. It's got everything a healthy orc needs. It damaged my intelligence. Yep. <laughs> That's Come what an orc to me needs. through fire and war. Another Dwemer lantern. I welcome you. That reminds me, we should there should I should do a remix of um Lou Vega's Mambo number no. five. Uh Lou Dagoth. Uh, Great House number no. six. <laughs> um, um, imagine if you open the door to the thing above and just as we're going down the corridor it just starts playing bam, 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 A little bit of Nerevar. <laughs> My life. Uh, we went back down. Oh, ah, you found us. Yeah. Wait, I think we missed a spot up here. Oh no, we didn't. Wait, hang on, maybe we did. I can see a couple of doors we didn't visit. Come back this way, you guys. Okay. Oh, I'm a dumbass. Where? Um. All right, let's let's well, run back up. Downstairs doors. Oh, did they repopulate in here? There's a new guy. Um, oh no, my mistake. I think I misread the map. Yeah, we can go back down. We can actually jump down. Leroy! These Anwars don't forgot who I, that I'm really him. Oh sweet Nerevar, I'm gonna Welcome, chin. Moon and Star. Ah. I have prepared a place for you. <laughs> He's prepared a place for me. A position yeah. even. Oh, well, there's lightning at this door. Can you hear you? My enchants <laughs> get increased? Oh, if you use an enchanted weapon, I think it... Well, rather, oh, okay. if, you, if you spend a charge on an enchanted <laughs> weapon. For, for beating someone to death with a sword. Oh, you're better at enchanting. Uh, oh, got another demon longbow over here. Um, I think we're past that at this point. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, another Dwemer lantern, though. I am collecting them. Well, Dwastrid, what bow do you have? Astrid? Hello? Yeah? Hello? Yeah, I've got the face shift though. Okay, yeah. So um, it hurts better as well. I, Come, how much damage does it do? Bring Wraith Guard to the heart chamber. Um, Together, let us free the cursed false gods. Attack 1 to 28. Together, let us free the cursed false gods. 
Um, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm sure that's fine. I think the demon longbow that was over there does a little over 30, but um, you have to summon it and stuff, and if it's if it's complicated for you, then don't bother. For me, it only did 122. No, no, that's that's just the base bow. When you summon the Daedric one, uh, it does like okay. I think 36 off the top of my head. But wait, right, so it's a bow whose power is letting you summon a different, ah, better bow. So you're enjoying your enjoying your fireball. Yeah, I don't know if I'm making it work properly. Dragon scale helmet. It does look pretty good. Um, and it is a better a rating than the bear hammer. helmet. I'll I'll you try it. Or a repair hammer. You know what? It, with the ears, it looks kind of good. Let me see. Okay, okay. I don't think it's actually left space for the ears on the old model. So. <laughs> yeah. Oh, nope. stuck behind machines. This is not how I go out. Um. Oh, oh! There's some more Nate Swimmer. No, no, no. Kitchen <laughs> furnishings. I already have a problem. <laughs> Uh, let's go back the way we came and check those side passages. Not here. No, there's oh, a what's in with here? more doors. Yes, one more. In a tower. Oh, there's a tube down here oh, that should be There's a Dagoth rude boy in here. Dagoth rude boy, is that a tentative Yes. If you check his corpse, it's there's Dagoth. Irvin. Oh, okay. Irvin's a pretty good name. Let's be real. Oh. Veruz Bethrimo died in here with a full, well, uh, an incomplete set of glass armor, but a pretty substantive one all the same. Oh, this must be one of the sacred relics, the Crozier of St. Lothus. Oh, hell yeah. Well, we'd better take that take that back to the temple. Yeah, I think I'm still good in good standing with the temple. Yeah, you're, you. you're fine. <laughs> I'm, I'm not I'm not exiled from that many places. I don't think. Uh, just the legion, Asvadoran, and the temple. No, oh, no, no, no. The, the cult is still fine with me. I am, after all, never there. Wait, uh, but this is this is for the temple, yeah. not. Oh. So okay. the cult, well, is, yeah, the imperial cult, is, is um, like the nine divines. Oh, that's not that Talos fucker from Skyrim, is it? <laughs> he is. I think at the time of Morrowind, he is still one of them. Tell me, please, tell me more about Talos. Um, I, I hate just having a moment to myself to think and, and commune with the universe while I'm going my white run. Please fill that silence with more fucking Talos talk. <laughs> yum, yum. I'm just gonna levitate down this pipe to see if there's anything good. Um. No, it looks so like lava to me. Yes. I confirmed when I put my toe in it, it was lava. <laughs> oh, oh. Are missing out here? Okay. An entirely serious. No, I think we've just got to make our way to the lower facility now, I guess. <laughs> that was like a freaking Scooby-Doo moment with the two of you like power walking. Welcome there, we like, Running between Together we like, shall speak for the I've, law I've and the land and shall drive the mongrel dogs of the Empire from Morrowind. Wait, don't talk over Dagoth though, because he's only going to say these things once. Together we shall speak for the law and the land. We shall drive the mongrel dogs of the Empire from Morrowind. Um, mana me up, boys. Oh, yeah. Well, I can't drive. Yes, you can. <laughs> You're the only one of us here who can. Alright. Well, my character can't drive. Oh, boy. Ooh. 
Good. Dagoth Muthis. Yet another named boy. Oh, another Dagoth. He's come running towards us. He doesn't seem too friendly. Um, right, let's back off and see yeah. if we can calm him or if we can go sneak to him and see what he has to say. Come this way. Let's wait, leave. wait. This is a big off. It's a vampire. Yep, let's leave. Is that possible? I thought we okay. got them all. Have I got chameleon? I'm going to get invisibility and try and talk to him. Um, I've got sneak calm good. Creature, but it's not good. Um... Do any of my scrolls calm people down? I've got invisibility wild. That's pretty good. Oh, I've got a scroll of invisibility. Talking to her? You can char calm creature 0 to 80 points. Scroll of Dedraza's masterful eye. Right, let's give that a go. Huh? Oh, it worked! Yo! Hell yeah. <laughs> he, he says, I'm not here to talk, I'm here to fight. Okay, Dagoth Gilvoth. How long does it last? Did I not come oh, not that long. <laughs> He's already angry. <laughs> I'm not here to talk, I'm here to fight. Okay. Well, he I got what he wished for. Dagoth's blood ring. Oh, um, keep those in the mentor, if nothing else. Well, maybe give it to me because I've been collecting all the Dagoth amulets, and I'm going to I'm going to power myself up with every single one of them. Um, okay. Oh yeah. Right before we fight. I'm not even going to read what I've they got, do. If some if somebody I've got a, in the I've got a uh, bunch of stuff from uh, like Akatosh's ring, a bunch of like. God themed ones that I'm just going to use for the last fight as well. Ah, yeah, Is this sense. how you honor the sixth house and the tribe unmourned? Come to me openly. You've got to give it to a stealth. dead thief who got this far into Dagoth Ur's house. <laughs> he was sneaky. He, he has a Daedric sword, short sword. Where, where is 32? Okay. <laughs> oh, that would be pretty good. Oh, no. No, thank you. Um, I guess I can take it. Uh, yeah. I'll take this Glummer Lantern. Oh, I forgot to install the mod where Dagotha reads everything out loud. Oh well. I'll do an impression of him. Impression of who? Dagoth Yeah. Because you, you... When you speak to him, it's just a text box as usual. Uh, Who did that? Me? <laughs> sorry. Can't prove anything. I'm not sorry, I'm just trying to level up so I can actually cast it more. Okay. I think for the final fight, I'm going to enumerate my crossbow to be I got a bunch of silver bolts with this guy's name on it he's a vampire right he's got to at least kind of be something like a vampire he keeps making them you know no, I'm just gonna have my oh you've got a crossbow um okay I'm not sure if he's I think he is through this door. Everyone come in. Alright. I mean, it looks right. awfully like him. Let's all walk slowly towards but him. But then they all look the same to me. <laughs> you're, but you're one of them. Dagoth Ur welcomes you, Nerevar, my old friend. But to this place where destiny is made, why have you come unprepared? Well, I don't know. I'd say we've come pretty prepared. Dagoth right. Ur, you're wanted on 6,132 counts of murder, 5,231 counts of kidnapping, and uncounted counts of being a dick, one among thousands. How do you plead? He is number one among thousands. Um, yeah, right. Okay, Dagoth. 
Strange. This is not the outcome I did not. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let me let me try again. Strange. This outcome I did not foresee. That you would come unprepared. This is the place of destiny. And destiny may only be shaped by the holder of Kagrignak's tools. I do not know what to think you think to accomplish, but to raise your hand against me, and I shall destroy you. Um, right, I think you need to give me all of Kagrignak's tools. One of us has to be holding all of them. Okay, uh, I've got... Uh... Oh, I, I think, still got Keening. I think you still have Keening, yeah. Yeah, pop, pop that on the floor there. Um, can you remember how we're supposed to defeat him? We're supposed to strike the heart first with Keening or first with Sunder? I think first with... You Plan to defeat Dagoth. Uh, hang on, there we go. You, you Let's just read it in front of him. <laughs> you, should, you should probably enumerate these. He's <laughs> like getting out the tactics manual and how to do it. <laughs> while he's standing here in his underwear. Well, he did. I mean, he did tell true. us we came unprepared. So uh, hold on, hold yeah. a minute. Just uh, just a minute, Dagos. Uh, how dare we're you, preparing. Can I? How dare you, Philosopher? Can I have a minute? <laughs> you can just hold off just to a teensy, yes, teensy it's, second there. It's um, it's hammer and then. Some sunder it first, and then stab it once it's sundered. Yep. Um, I probably should en en enumerate these, but I think I won't, just because that would be funnier. Right. Mm -hmm. Hang on, let me try and emulate. Dagoth uh, welcomes you, Nerebar. Okay. Have you something more to say? Come unprepared. I am glad that this time you did not come unprepared. My only other option is goodbye. Um, Alright, let's try again. Have we broken it? Uh oh. Um, I have Keening, Sunder, and Wraith God. Let's leave the cell and come back in again. Still at a dignified pace. Of course. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. I'll leave the last, I guess, since I've got... Like, All right, our days say we come prepared, but also quick team huddle. Are we? Are we? Are we ready? <laughs> <laughs> do we? Do we now? To, oh, okay, okay. <clears throat> we come before you prepared, Nerva. No, we're not. <laughs> but we're. Him. Go, okay, okay. Let's go again. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> we right. come before you prepared. To take off her. Oh boy. He, okay. That's his only dialogue option. Um, do I need to equip oh, them? What if we just start hitting him? Uh, right, I almost just equipped Keening without Rafe Rafe guy. I just annihilated myself. Wait, let's Oh, I'm over encumbered, of course. Um Wait, why oh because you're the face of the Uh Okay, well this sucks. Nope, he still doesn't want to talk to us. What could we possibly have done wrong? Is it because you initiated the conversation before one of us had all the items? I guess so, but... Um, tell you what, what if somebody else... Nobody start the conversation, but I'm going to give... Ed, I'm going to give you all the items. Mm -hmm. One sec. Nobody else has tried to talk to him, right? Absolutely do not do that. Right. Sounds like a challenge to me. Right, pop, pop put them all on the ground. Do you think I have to equip them or just have them? Um, may as well equip them. Make sure to use Wraith Guard first. How? I think you can only equip one of the weapons at a time, but whatever. Right. Uh, Sunder first, right? <clears throat> yeah, I'm ready for your best day, Goth uh, impression. Gonna make it sound like Gilbert Gottfried. Oh, nothing it is. It began here. It will end here. 
Have you any parting words? That's one option. Or would you prefer to skip the speeches and get to our business? Second option. You are the challenger here, after all, never mind. To you goes the courtesy of the first blow. So we have our business or parting words. Do you, you know some parting words? Feels like we should. We should. Now that you have come to me here, there can be but one result. Many times I have considered offering to share this place with you. I considered offering to accept your oath of service. You might try to buy my trust by giving me Wraithguard, Keening, and Sunder. I thought we might, we might once again be friends, comrades, brothers in arms. <laughs> There's no option to just lose the game by giving him the <laughs> Wow. <laughs> I think Imagine originally like... there was um, a quest plan yeah, that... to take his side instead, yeah. but it, it was way too expansive, so they, they cut Imagine it. being railroaded like this by a game. Where's the player agency? <laughs> <laughs> but I have won this place and power by right of conquest, by right of daring and enterprise. I will not risk it to cunning and deceit. I offer you no deals. If you are my enemy, I cannot trust you. And even if you are not my enemy, I cannot let you live. It will all be decided here. I believe I will prevail, but I cannot be sure, and I am vain enough that, should I fall, I would wish to be remembered in my own words. So if you have any final questions you would ask, ask them now. I have final questions I would ask you. If you Final questions, I guess. My first question is Are you really never far from war? Obviously, I'm going to say I am, yeah. By the grace of gods and fate, I am a cup, and I'm never far from war. That is bitter. The gods and fates are cruel. I serve to faith for the ones who have never far. And you repaid me with death. I hope this time it will be you who pays for your faithlessness. My second question is, if you win, what will you do with the power from the heart? Will you make yourself a god? Establish your own thearchy? Or will you complete a Kulakan and dispute control of Tamriel with these septims? Or will you share the heart with your followers as I have, and breed a new race of divine immortals. I mean, what do we, what do we think? Make myself a god, complete a again. There's an option for, I have my own secret plan for the heart, which I... <laughs> If you select that one, you've first got to tell us what the secret plan is. Uh, Otherwise it's too much of a cop-out. I'm going to make everywhere except the ghost fence ash storms. <laughs> I'm going to charge people to come across the border. <laughs> <laughs> My god, it's so devious. <laughs> a gated, he's going to create a gated community. <laughs> <laughs> the ghost gated community. <laughs> it's beautiful. We've got all this, this nice infrastructure. We've got that mountain. Think of the views. You know, once the ash storms are gone, think of the views. It's foolproof, boys. He's going to make the Dunmer pay for it. <laughs> well, perhaps there may be surprises in store for me yet. Or perhaps you obscure your plans on principle. Or perhaps you are an instinctive bluffer. Yeah, he's going there. No matter. My final question is, if I had offered to let you join me, would you have surrendered Wraithguard, Sonder, and Keening to me to seal your own? Uh... <laughs> no, I would never join you. No, I would never surrender the tools. Yes, perhaps with the right guarantees. Or yes, if I had a cunning plan. <laughs> uh, I know what I would pick, but I don't want to influence your decision. You're the one holding gonna, the items currently. You can do I'm as you wish. I'm going to go with the maximum... An interesting response. 
You may have been willing to join me, but never to surrender the tools. Very interesting. I'm glad I didn't try to bargain with you. And now, if you have any questions, ask them. Otherwise, you remain the challenger. I await your first blow. Uh, I've got to ask the questions. So we can ask him what his plan is for the heart, what his plan is for the sixth house, or for the Dunmer, how he justifies his crimes. Oh, what happened to the Dwemer? Interesting. Uh, or why he's building a cooler can. I'll just go through them in order. Mm -hmm. For the heart, I will continue to draw divine power from the heart and distribute it to my kin and followers. I will continue to broadcast divine power upon the blight winds so that it will touch each soul on Vardenfell and then more broadly still across the water to the rest of Morrowind and all Tamriel. In time, every mortal in Tamriel shall feel the liberating contact of the divine. Okay, lovely. For the sixth house, the sixth house will serve as the elite cadre of our movement. As cultists evolve through various stages of enlightenment, they will become, as suits their abilities, either holy warriors or priests. Their duty is to prepare themselves for service, their joy and liberation to enter ever more deeply into the profound enlightenment of the... Of the... you cut off. Okay. Prof profound Dunmer. enlightenment of what? Uh, Ed? And small little sleepers, blah blah blah. Um, can you hear me, Ed? I can hear you, yeah, can you hear me? Uh, you, you were a bit choppy there for a minute. Um, you said something about enlightenment and then sleepers, but that's all I caught. Uh, he said that they'll get the enlightenment of the divine dream world. So basically, he's going to turn more of them into sleepers. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, for the Dunmer, I will free the Dunmer from the imperial yoke and cast down the false gods of the temple. And will instead install my yoke. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, no, on principle, the first sentence is fine. I will lead them out of their ancient superstitions and gift them with intimate knowledge of the divine. Again, if the divine wasn't all weird, uh, you know, demon aids, I'd be, I'd be down with this. Then, perhaps, when Morrowind is once again restored to its ancient glories, it will be time to consider whether the Dunmer should cultivate ambitions of empire. Okay. <laughs> I just love that this game, this is like the second guy who you can ask, how do you justify your crimes? <laughs> <laughs> we, we asked Vivek this as well, didn't we? Well, it's uh, yeah. fitting. It's, you mean the inevitable suffering and destruction caused by war? Then I accept the burden of leadership. The Sixth House cannot be restored without war. Enlightenment cannot grow without the risk of upsetting the tradition bound and complacent herd. And the Mongol stop using the word Mongol man, it's it's twenty twenty four. And the <laughs> Mongol armies of the Empire cannot be expelled from Morrowind without bloodshed. As I have charity and compassion, I grieve. But our mission is just and noble. Uh, what happened to the t Ah boo, <laughs> I have no idea what I have no idea what, and then you cut off. Not sure. Oh, cut off when? I have no idea what happened to the Dwemer. Which is a bit of a piss day. Oh, does that, is that all he said? No, no. He uh, goes on. What happened to the Dwemer? I have been denied the opportunity to study Wraithguard, and I'm not sure how much of Kagranak's lore was invested in his tools. I have long studied Kagranak and have now come to admire his wisdom and craft. Some day, after the campaigns of the Sixth House are secure, I hope to have time to dedicate to this mystery. So, I mean, he doesn't know either. 
Uh, and... First, it will be champion of my armies, liberating first Vardenfell, then Morrowind, and then perhaps the rest of Tamriel. Second, it will serve as a sower and cultivator of the divine substance derived from the heart. So a, a giant robot that's basically like crop dusting, spreading the weird demon aids, Ashwind style. Lovely. to defy the Empire, liberate mortals from superstition, and to glorify our crusade against the gods. Right? So just normal CEO stuff. Average LinkedIn post. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, I'm afraid I've, my only remaining option is I'm finished talking, defend yourself. So I guess get ready. Uh, before you click on that, Master, can you come down here for a sec? Yeah. Use up any buffs. Stand in the middle up. between the two of us. Just gonna try and get a picture. The trouble is, is I that he keeps shifting to the left, and Ed's now standing in a bit of a weird place relative to. I mean, I I, I can finish talking because he said the first blow is ours, right? Oh, when that's true. Yeah, go yeah. ahead. Right. My journal has been updated. Yeah, what does it he say? says again. He, he says again. Go ahead. You're the challenger to you guys. The first play. So we can, we can pose and take a picture. For old time's uh, sake. Uh, yeah, yeah. Take a. Can we take a selfie. We can even take one with him. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Hang on. Let's uh, arrange a little bit like this. Easy call, dude. A little little bit of a curve. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll, I'll I'll be on the end. Ed, can you come forwards a little bit in between me and Astrid? That's where Dagoth Air is. Oh, in he's in a different place for me. Oh. Oh. Yeah. yeah, you said he was moving to the left. I was like, what? No, he's moving to the right. Oh, to his right. Yeah, sorry. Oh. I meant as in relative from, from those of us that were facing him. Sorry. Um, it's a bit of an awkward angle. I'll, well, I'll take it. I'll, I'll go here. Well. I'll go here. That makes more okay. sense. I'm just waiting for him to do one of the poses. <laughs> come on, do the hand thing. Do the hand flame thing. Oh, the, the laugh is good. Laugh is good, but come on. Just set set fire to your hand. Hand flame come thing. <laughs> hand flame thing. You're in a volcano. It's it's. Come appropriate. on. There we hey. go. There it is. Okay, beautiful. Okay. Uh, right. Well. Um, everyone buff up, and then I've got... Fisticuffs. Um, wait, let me see if I've got anything that buffs fisticuffs. Oh, I forgot I've disabled my menu so I can't actually see what anything does. Uh, Olaf's fist. Have I even... okay. Um, I should find... Uh, do, you want, do you want the weapons back? The tools? Uh, we can discuss that later. Let us first. Okay. Oh, do we, we feed him and then we go find the heart? It's not yeah. in this room. Ed, do you want oh, okay. to... We're I, I, engaging in fisticuffs was... in this room. Oh, are we? Yes. All right. To you goes well, the then. first blow, since you're holding the weapons. You the first blow. Whoever's currently will... holding the weapons yeah. is Nerevar. Yeah. Well, obviously this is a serious and solemn moment and, and should be approached with all dignity. Oh, look over there! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, oh God, he's casting. He has surprisingly low stamina. Although I suppose there are the well, three of us. He hasn't been working out. It's been in the loop cave down here. Yeah, get him. My hand to hand skill is only increasing, Dead with her. That's you're using a you bow. Are. Come on. Ooh. Hit zero and join in the fisticuffs. 
didn't know this was the protocol. I thought we were it is. Going. Well, I've told you it is now, so put your bow away. Well, I did. Oh, you're still using your bow on my screen. Are you really punching us, Yeah. Oh, that's weird. It hasn't synchronized very well. Well, I'm going to have to back off. I'm going to be dead. We forgot to lay our marks down. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Oh dear. Okay, well, make your way back to us as quickly as you can. Um, yep, sure, I'll, I'll keep him busy. Uh, check what this place is called. They got a uh, outer facility or something like that? Inner facility, maybe? A uh, uh, ca cavern facility, I think. Oh gosh, I'm nearly dead too. I am dead. Uh, uh, uh. Right, we, oh. we've been put in our place. We need we need to buff up more spectacularly before we're ready for that. Hey man, I'm still here. Well, if you succeed in beating him. I really am no of Yep. <laughs> Quickly, let us hurry back. And let's put something... How do we get to the mark? Let's just say, get into it. Mm. Oh, I know how. Because well, he's trying to run towards you guys. He's not attacking me. Um, every, 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 every time well, he gets up, Don't, don't kill him, him just down. yet. Just leave him, leave him be control. if he's not attacking you. So that we can... So that I can actually um, be there to see it. I'm just following him and, and knocking him over with punches. So I'm, my, my punches do almost no damage even once he's on the floor. Dude. I That's see, right. I see. I'm, I'm just keeping him basically rugby tackled on the floor. <laughs> the mighty take on there and the rebound never far. We're basically very slowly like crawling our way in a weird jujitsu grapple towards the door of the facility. <laughs> and we're trying to hold him back. God, I do no damage. Maybe, but I'm determined to. He's only fighting with his hands, so we should too. I mean, he's got some spells. This is true. And the spells are really what are doing the damage. Oh, fuck you, buddy. I didn't say you could leave. I cut you for three minutes. Minutes, you guys? <laughs> uh, we're approaching the ghost fence. You're, you're, near, no, you're not even in the ghost fence? No, because you respawn at the nearest temple. Oh, yeah. Yeah, good point. I found the world's most efficient way to level up your hand to hand. Uh, beating Dago Thur's ass while he's trying to get through this door, apparently. Yeah, so I should, I should rest and meditate on what I've learned, but who has the time? Top of the volcano, and then it's just a bit dark. I found the technique. I every time he gets up from being on the floor, I just level a power attack, knocks him straight back down. Health is regenerating faster than I'm uh, dealing damage to it, by the way. 
<laughs> he's back to like two. He's back to like two thirds. Well, that's only fair. We'll get him this time. Oh, I'm a, I should just cast Mark. Are we still not allowed to do anything except punch him? Well, we'll see how it goes this time. So I cast Mark in the way in the future when I cast the cool legend. Quick turn over here. So it's me. I've not been this guy. Sniper Cliff Racer. Uh, we're in the ghost fence, we're about halfway there now. That the uh, the whole temple complex is just named after him. You can only really get away with that if you're called something like Dagotha. Yes. So like get into a castle and it's just like big castle. Something like, like, like Bob. Emo, <laughs> uh, not as well. Does what not work? If, if he was called something like that emo. Uh, Instead of Dagoth. Oh, right, 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 yeah. <laughs> I only just got it. Very good. It's I like that the, the ash storms are kind of sputtering on our on our run back. Like, there's, there's moments of clarity. It must be linked to Dagoth Ur's help. Have you turned as a fake? <laughs> Every time there's clear skies, that's the only Alright, we're in. Get your hands off me. You chimer. For, for enjoying a Chinese meal. <laughs> what is the charge? Gentlemen, <laughs> <laughs> I am the man who's got him by the penis, people. <laughs> what is the charge? Founding a house? The succulent sick house? <laughs> <laughs> okay, before we step through the door, Australi, let us cast our mark. Let us cast it on the I wouldn't quite say sanctified, but at least the stable ground of the uh, Dwemer Ruin. Uh, why am I looking through my potions? Uh, amulet of Mark. Potion of getting good. Okay, I'm ready. Mark. If you don't know the spell, I can give you the amulet. Is it 
I think it's Marco and Polo. Oh, yes, of course. I keep forgetting. Oh. Was that Marco? Yeah. Okay, very good. Um, well, let's go in. I mean, she's still there. It can't be Polo. Yeah, that's true. I, I mean, unless she doesn't have anything else down. Never mind. Oh, yeah. Are you ready, Astrid? What are you doing? Well, I was gonna put my dragon skin, but I already used it today. Ah, oh, okay. Well, I see this is still going on. Dagotha is <laughs> beginning to regret the idea of fighting someone who is, uh... Oh, 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 no. I can't move. Uh, do you, need, do you need to heal? We can keep him down. That was really dead up. You know you're not allowed to use spells. Now I'm getting terrible at everything. I found the sleep the Vespa. You keep punching him. What I do is I just watch him every time he gets up and then I land a power attack and it knocks him off. Okay, you down. do that. And, and then you I, do I deal damage. more damage while he's down while he's down. Yeah. That's that's teamwork. Well, that's... that's efficiency. I wonder what it is, whether it's agility or something like that. Imagine if it was vanilla Morrowind and then he and I, it, like, we would all just be missing each other. Dagotha included. I'd like to believe that he has perfect accuracy, but I know he doesn't. I'm just no, going in I'm first so... person and just, I'm just landing a pass on his chin every time he gets up. Get down. Hey, get down. <laughs> Astrid, what were you saying? I like can't move because I'm over encumbered because I'm so weak now that I've died. Are oh, you? Yeah, oh, you died again, a second time. I had this bright idea of punching him to there. That's she just did she just respawn? No, um, wait, did did you die twice, Astrid? Oh yeah. Uh, well, how do you think? What do you think happened the first time? I understood what happened yeah. the first time. I just didn't realize you died just now as well. I just said I did. Or maybe you didn't hear because I keep... Um, when, in any case, it doesn't matter. You can just drop a few things that you don't need at the fort. We can always pick them up I later. That'll be like safe. I what I do you need, like... really, except for your clothes what? and your weed? You must have been hoarding quite a lot if you had to drop that much. Well, no. I had, like, 300 capacity and then it decreased to, like, 260. Yeah, so you were carrying within 40 of your max capacity. That's hoarding. How am I supposed to know that? We only need the stuff you're wearing and then a few other things. I'm hoarding because I'm gonna I'm gonna drink like 200 potions when <laughs> um, when we face him again. Well, he's gonna keep. He also can keep going back, which is which is the issue. We need to fight him repeatedly and, until we get to the heart. Anyway, cast a polo when you're ready. This must be incredibly tedious to watch. <laughs> we're, we're doing it. We're gonna do it. Uh, we will not be able to get get away with this uh, beyond this initial room. No, I don't think so. This is us being lenient on him, offering him a chance to. Ah, so good of you to join us at the last moment, Astrid. <laughs> Australia, excuse me. Show him, show him what we mongrel dogs think of him. Uh, heal yourself if you need to. Ooh, that was close. Oh, again! Jeez, he really one-shots you. Okay, well, once we get into the big chamber, if he keeps aggroing on you, we're gonna have a bad time. Oh, I'll, we'll have a fine time. Now, you, now I have to dump even more stuff. Oh, okay, we got him. Um, right, well, I don't, I don't know what you're going to do when we're actually fighting him, because if he attacks, if he decides he wants to attack you, then... Well, I guess you're going to have to dodge a lot. You're going to have to use ranged attacks. We'll go in first, and you just stay behind it, us. That's hopefully, the plan. I, I think, is it just this pull, because she used a bow and we used fists? Do you believe in honourable warfare? Um, 
Either way, I think Maybe. as long as we make sure it's one of the rest of us who does the. Uh, but if, if we, go in if first, we step the into the next chamber first, then it should be all right. Although I am going to do something a bit silly when we step into the next chamber, so don't attack him immediately. You doing something silly? Let me see if I've got anything, any rings that fortify strength or something, because then Astrid can wear it to be able to carry slightly more. Also, my healing is not that strong, it's weak. Ah. Let me see if I've got like, a ring that heals. Like, he, like, makes me, like, stuck. I don't know if it's the same thing. So I can't move, it says, like, over in combo. And then my health goes down like at least half and then it keeps going down and by the time I start ca casting Restore, it's like too late. Okay, I've put an amulet of health on the ground, you can have that in your spell slot. Okay, if you, okay there you go. Um, let me see if I've got anything else. Then I have to like select and by the time I've selected it I'll already be dead. If you press R it, it brings it up immediately if you've got it as your active spell. Does what active spell mean? Oh yeah, but I'm I'll be casting other stuff. Use your bow. Or have it as one of your quick number um what do you call it? Number abilities. Yeah, well I already put other things. This is why I have a spell that just constantly gives me two mana, uh, two health regen. Oh, um, I, I just realised Spellbreaker actually gives me silence for 30 seconds. Uh, not on me, but on, on the target. So he will yeah, be I forced guess. to use melee. Okay. Um, so I'll do that. But anyway, what when we go in there, do don't attack him immediately. Because I intend to do something very silly. Okay. Um, <clears throat> I'm down to clap. Right, what am I going to use? I think I'm going to use the War Axe, and I've got Spellbreaker. Oh. I've almost discharged the Sword of the Monarch just getting through his minions. He's got a few hits left in it. Um. Right, in we go. Are you ready? We want to have more arrows. Oh yeah, sure. Um, let me give you. I'm, I won't give you the Daedric. Actually, yeah, I'll give you the Daedric ones. How actually, much carry weight have you got? Uh, ten. Okay, you should always, just be able to I, carry these. I've got like a hundred. I can carry some stuff for you if you're. I'll give it back. Uh, oh, if you've got that many arrows, are they light arrows? Because I was going to give her Daedric ones. Four Daedric arrows is one one carry weight. I've got 14 Dire Flame Arrows and 10 Ebony Arrows. Um, I'm going to give you 25 Daedric Arrows, which are the best arrows in the game. But the they are arrows. quite heavy. I'd equip them first, because then you'll get lighter quite quickly. Alright, I'm going to be cast by Mark while I think about it. In front of this door. We have purified this chamber, brothers. We have cured this location. Are we ready for the final breach? Yeah, this is the last one, right? Yes. Definitely, yes. By, definitely. Well, uh, we don't know that. I mean, but this is definitely... I mean, he greeted us in here. This must be his stronghold. Um, but yeah, when we go I'm inside, there might be some thing. sort of strange moment of um, incredible resonance because we're so close to the heart with uh, Kagrinak's tools. So watch okay. out for what happens in there. Are you ready? On three. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. I can't go in, you know. Uh, why? Well, it's like a giant ball. Oh, um, on your end then, press, uh... What a fool you are. I'm a god! How can you kill a god? What a grand and intoxicating uh, hold on. innocence. I could you be so naive? I tried to toggle no AI escape. off because I wanted to no do something. No recall or intervention um, can work in this place. Come, lay down your weapons. It, it is didn't not work. Too late for my He's so powerful, I can't even turn his AI off. Right, I'm just going to hop down here for a second. Damn, he's chimming. 
Oh my god, is that a cooler can? Oh, cry. Crap. Well, that's not up to me. Oh, I am definitely dead. Okay, I saved myself just in time. I don't know why Toggle AI isn't working though. Um, I've toggled Collision and everyone's chasing me. What I wanted to do, I literally just wanted to make him... Well, I'll show you when Astrid gets here. Yeah, Astrid, if you type in a TCL into the console, you know how to open it, right? It's the, it's the button underneath Escape. Uh, where did Dagoth uh, go? Uh, I didn't see where he went after he followed you off to the left. Uh, don't tell forward. me he jumped down there. Right, let's I leave and hopefully he will have respawned. This was an absolute clusterfuck. Uh, I can't leave. It's a ball for me now. <sighs> okay. There's a total object collision. I, I'll tell you what, yeah, well, well, yeah, let's do that. Let's rejoin Astro, it'll be the Oh, wait, wait, way. I can, I can, I can cast recall. I did on just going the door. Oh, teleportation magic does not work here. Right. Um, so what, what's it, OCL? Oh, maybe I need to do it in... In the chat? I don't know. So what's the command to toggle? Um, TCL. T TCL, that's it. Um, have you managed to open it, Astrid? Well, yeah, that's it. What, the door? No, but I've opened the console. Type in TCL. TCL? Yep. Press TCL? Yep, and then press enter. Yeah. Um, so okay. the so issue... What... Yep. So come come to where I am, so you go just inside the ball, but don't do anything else. Um, I'm in a great ball of nether... Oh, oh wait, I can, I can just... And then press, press TCL again. again. Type TCL again, excuse me. Okay, all right, we're all in here. Um, the problem is that because we killed Dagoth uh, uh, without Astrid, the cell didn't update for her, which meant the ball is still closed for her. Okay. Um, I don't know, can you guys give me some magicka, by the way? Yeah. There's a cast marker in here. Um. I guess, yeah. You should, yeah. It doesn't matter what Ed and I do because... Well, I'll do it too because why not? Um... Right. Um, I'll give you my amulet. Like... Has it got to do with the charge? Uh, maybe? If you're out of charge, then yeah, it won't work. Yeah, it's 7 out of 16. Uh, oh, I'm wearing it, of course, that's why I couldn't find it. Um, right, it's just at your foot and the circle thing. What, what's this for? Um, I, I don't know who put that there. It's Amulet of Mark. Oh, hi, Mark. <laughs> so. Want it back? Uh, no, but I do want some magicka. Please. Please, sir. Can I have some more? Okay, that's that's plenty. Um, are you ready? Mm -hmm. Can we all see the door? Yep. All right. I'll go in first. Uh, all right, join me. All right, he hasn't come back, but that's okay. I'll just I'm gonna try and spawn him in on console. Let's let's get rid of this annoying woman. I have you. Oh, with the console or? Uh, I think you can get rid of her. I would say the old fashioned way. <clears throat> the non 2020. Oh. I've completely forgotten how to do this. Give me, give me a sec. No worries. You're chilling, bro. Don't even, don't even trip, dog. 
Sometimes a man's got a chin. my concert. Your what? Damn it. I split the monarchs all out. It'll have to be Skull Crusher from here, boys. Well, I guess Sund is actually a pretty good weapon. No charge either. Okay, are you ready? Are you guys next to me? I am ready, guy. What a fool you are. Oh, fuck. I'm a yeah. god. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. What a grand and intoxicating <laughs> innocence. How could you be I'm so naive? There Sunday. is no escape. No recall or intervention can work in this place. <laughs> Come, lay down your weapons. Oh, it is not piss. too late for my mercy. Got too many freaking spells. There we go. Oh, he resisted magic. Uh. Hey, you suck, Dagoth. There. Oh, there we go. He's been silenced for a bit. I really, really need some magicka. I think I've got some healing potions. Uh, he's not taking any damage, I'm asking. I hope I'm wrong. I am over encumbered. But for how long? Okay. Got enough magic Oh, uh, you're right, it's not taking any damage on my screen either. Yeah, no, he's not online either. And I'm not able to gain any health. Um. Oh, I, I think it went down a little bit. did it? Oh, yeah. It's going down a little. He keeps healing it back, it like sucks through. <laughs> I don't know what that spell is he's got around him. It's kicking our asses. Okay, I can heal again. Okay, we're gonna have to run away from him. Follow me, quickly! Jesus Christ, how oh, horrifying. Shit, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> I mean by, my weapon has no effect. Yeah, same here for the crossbow. Is he only taking magic damage? Mine works, but it's not doing much. Oh, it's because uh, Astra has divine arrows. He, he's not taking anything from normal weapons. Mm, okay. Uh, or maybe he's too well. close to the heart and we actually can't kill him. No, we, we definitely can. I swear we can. It is possible. Then we destroy the heart, right? Yeah, he um, no, him. you can kill him. He just keeps coming back, I think. Damn it. Out. Oh, I'm right, down. Right. I've completely forgotten how we're supposed to kill him. I don't know if there is a special way or if he's just got a really high level oh, no. fire spell. Uh, jump, jump, jump over to me. It says teleportation magic does not work here. But why? Where did you mark? Um, same place Astrid marked. Oh. I think if it's anything, maybe it's further in than the anti room. I guess the special room doesn't count. Well, it looks like maybe we won't get it this episode. We're too weak. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I've got the teleportation thing again. 
Oh, and okay. I have to drop well, even more that's bullshit. Even no, that's bollocks. I'm just going to send her on sale. Um, what was it called? In a uh, facility? Cavern, cavern facility. Cavern facility. It's not found. Dagothair cavern facility? That's what I typed in. Okay, well, inner facility works. Then lower facility. Right, I'm going to set down a new mark thing. Oh, I can't because Astrid's got it. Well, you heard what we're doing, Astrid, right? Oh, facility cavern. Oh, it's the wrong way around. I guess it works outside the door, but not inside it. Um, anyway. Let me, uh, let me come out and reset my mark. Mine will be in the wrong place. I don't inside the door. I just need to, um, he's coming. <laughs> I've bounced over to a cooler can and he's just running big laps in the room with his giant terrifying legs. I'm going to wait till there's a free moment and then come uh, get past him. Well, I come back then once I've unloaded stuff. Um, yeah. Uh, oh. Okay, when I come through the door, there's just a terrifying expanse of nothingness. Um. What? When I, when I toggle object collision and walk back through the door, there's just a terrifying red mist expanse of nothingness. Uh, so that's because it's an interactive door. You've got to interact with it to go to the other oh, room. Oh, 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 okay, yeah, yeah. So I forgot I can get through to the actual door bit. Right. Sometimes I chim too hard and I rip the fabric of reality. Mm. Sometimes I cast too hard and it rips the chim. <laughs> um, I will need magic at a cast mark. Okay, I just because I'm not very good at it. Right, let me just uh, check if I have correct mark. Yes, I have. Good. I think part of the issue is that we have the experience of uh, Babies. a third of a person each. A third of what somebody would have in a normal playthrough. Uh, I think I successfully cast it there. Oh, yeah, I definitely. Um, Astra, did you just. You can just. You have to walk back here, right? I said you can type in something into the console. COC space and then it in quotation marks um, Dagoth a uh, comma facility cavern You can re remark here. Right, so is everyone marked? I have. Uh, does anyone have a spare? I know we've seen a lot of them. Does anyone got a spare magic bow? Demon bow? <laughs> Turns out that might actually be useful. Oh no, the demon bow won't be. A magic bow? Well, I've got phantom, which you can have. Well, I've only got the one I'm using. I have to drop all my bows. I don't have any arrows. Though, I've, only... I've only got bolts. Uh, so yeah, that's true. I've only got a bunch of bolts as well. Oh. Okay. Uh, well, I've got some frost spells, which I can bam, I guess. 
Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna bring I'm gonna summon everything I have. <laughs> everything that can be summoned, I will summon, and I'll do it right before we go in as well. Um, don't forget, I have to go in first. Um, I'd summon a creature, but I know that, that only means they attack you guys. Oh god, yeah, I'm gonna. Do, uh, it might happen when I do it as well, but let's be real honest, we weren't we weren't winning that fight. Um, is the ball the ball still here for you, Astrid, right? Uh, yeah. Open the console, click on it, oh. and then type in uh, disable. Wait, well, I open the console and click on the door. Yeah. Oh, it, it did it for both of us. Interesting. Anyway. Amazing. Um, door, right. Get on the floor. Everybody walk the dancer. I'm gonna. I'm gonna use all of the Dagoth amulets. How do I use my back again and use my dance? Right, I'm ready. You guys ready? I'm going in. Yep. <laughs> Run while you can! Oh, there he is. Death awaits you. Run while you can! Oh shit, it's obviously it's aggro to Astrid. Sheesh. This guy on the other hand. Right, I'm gonna have to put him down myself. He absolutely he demolished the things I summoned. And I get the feeling they were more interested in as attacking Astrid anyway. Why is everyone after me? What did I do? It's killing me once, not enough. Well, they act as excellent distractions for all about two seconds. Um... Oh, it looks like that one worked. He can only melee for a bit. Kill him. No, unfortunately that hit me. Oh, shit. Did I just <laughs> well, he doesn't seem to be casting it. Oh, it's because it's on... Yo, if I cast it on you, then, then I think it'll apply it to him because it's on 20 feet or 30 feet or something. And then, it, then the resistant test is based on you and not him. I'm, I'm aware that when I do an overhead chop of this current size, I'm just hacking right over the computer. <laughs> yeah, and now it's, I think, 30 seconds is up. Chop and violate his day, Goths. Um, well, um, this is horrifying. I, th <laughs> I think we're going to have to retreat backwards to the heart. Um... With him While chasing us. Oh, no. And I still want to do the thing of, uh, oh my god, and all his followers are here as well. Well, I can handle them. Those I can actually harm. Think of them all day. Ouch. I had a thing that absorbed spells, but I can't remember what I called it, unhelpfully. No oh, the benefit is that he's too big to follow us here. <laughs> hey. Classic big monster movie scene. You and oh my god. It's 2024. I have no idea what I called the ring in question. You can't have that many magic rings if you go to a battle. I have way too much crap. <laughs> <laughs> did I just call it Spell Drinker? Yeah, I think I did. Alright, I'm going to go to Dagoth and I'm going to wait for him to cast something. Oh, it I works! Oh, and his, his spells are so potent that it instantly refills all of my magicka. 
Um, I still don't get how we're supposed to get past his his ridiculous fire shield. Is that to damage except for fire? <laughs> um, no, I think it's just it's it deals fire damage to people that attack him, and it also absorbs some of the damage that gets dealt to him. Ugh, and I dropped Volundrung to teleport back here. Which was my um, main, ha main damage dealing weapon. Yeah, uh, how do I, I can give you uh, Sunder. I've got to go Yeah, maybe. Thunder. I'm going to try this Daedric short sword and see if it's any good. Well, it certainly does a lot of stagger, but it's still not damaging him. Oh, oh, I've, oh. I've knocked him into the lava. That works. Is it, is it Gilligan? I... I don't think it is. He's he's oh, just yeah, chilling now. Is he immune to fire damage? Hang on, I can I can it. I'm gonna go find out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is this is so scuffed. <laughs> hey, I'm just shooting at him. Well, yeah, my weapon has no effect, so I, but I'm hitting him and his health isn't going down. Is it still full? Oh. oh, excuse me. I found a random island here full of a bunch of people who are angry that I'm down here trying to shoot a dig off there. Excuse me. Fewer fireballs, please. Thank you. Is he still oh, at full health? Go. He's still at full health. Um, the the guys who tried to kill me... What, Billers? Um, so go me, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> I just solo that camp. Um... But yeah, his health is still at full, regrettably. Um, I really don't know how we're going to beat him. Then we have to take out the heart first, man. It's where he's getting the power from. Oh, I hit him. Don't know if you heard anything from down where you are. I shot an arrow of noise at him. Uh, I've, I've done the thing again where I can't see my um, menu. Uh, magic items and stuff. Uh, if you right click and click on your magic icon. Spells out that I can spam. Uh... Man, I really don't know what to do here. Um, he's too strong. I only scaled up his size. I didn't scale up like his stats or anything. And he is supposed to be really strong, but... Not literally invincible. that we can't we can't open the next door until we defeat this version of him um no we we can go to the heart now it's just i feel it'd be kind of disappointing to not at least kill him in this form once the issue with this form is that he just keeps coming back um but i don't know why he's borderline invincible i don't understand ain't no border about it baby I'm looking into it. I'm not. I'm not just sitting here watching you. <laughs> okay. I mean, does it matter if he's invincible if he's stuck in lava? No. 
love how there's these like little mine carts. Yeah, where where were they taking those? What are they doing with those? Oh, apparently, so I'm just reading up on it. Apparently Mora in Rebirth makes him stupidly strong. Um, and also in the vanilla game, he's level 35, whereas I'm level 20, I don't know about you guys, I'm level 28. Uh, Am I supposed to do something to the heart? Uh, yeah, we're supposed to destroy it. Did I destroy it? Um, are you at the heart? Yeah. Um, you can't destroy it except with the weapons that... Ed is carrying. Actually, I've got an idea. Why don't 